Not allowed to eat anything and you have to kill a boss before you die. Okay. So there's two bosses we can kill to complete this. I'm going to start with what I think is easier. That's Dragonfly. We either have to outheal our starvation using Wartox or just kill her before we die. And that's exactly what I'm going to try. Wolfkin starts with 200 hunger. And if we drain 75 hunger per day, then we have about two and a bit days to live. I'm going to try and become Wimpy because apparently Wimpy Wolfkin has a 25% slower hunger drain. <laughs> There's a terrarium chest. Okay, you know what? Perfect. Two healing salves, we can heal with that. Oh, also, the terrarium counts as a boss. Let's just grab that for now. There's three options, technically, then. Well, we might as well fight the terror guy, Eye of Cthulhu Terror Terraria. And uh, let's also not get hit. That would be nice. Oh no, we lost 20 health. What a tragedy. I have no idea where Dragonfly is, but I also don't know where Pikkin is. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, this is so far away, it just might connect to Dragonfly. Okay, this is in fact Pikkin. Wow, that's a lot of grass. And there's the Pantlu. Let's go uh, find something. Okay, this is definitely not Dragonfly. Wow, we even found more rope. Although, unfortunately, I think it's pretty clear we're not finding Dragonfly. But we can still complete the challenge by killing the Eye of Terror, because that counts as a boss. Perfect way to do it as well. There's a way to kill the Eye of Terror in one night. Let's do this. When he gets back up, put you to sleep and repeat. We're not gonna let you do anything. And just like that, he's dead. Alright, I killed the boss without eating anything. Now, we could finish here, but I want to go for the full 100% completion. We are going for the secret achievement. I am going to kill the ancient guardian without eating anything. Here is the pig king. Hopefully he's next to Dragonfly. You know what? We've changed plans. This world is so lucky for some reason that going for Dragonfly might be a good strategy. And you better lead me right to the Dragonfly Desert. That would be amazing. No way! Oh my god! And there's like a bunch of tumbleweeds I can get free grass. Okay, okay, as long as we... The only way this run can fail now is if I just die, which is still possible, but hopefully that doesn't happen. We can do this if we don't die. The lava phase is over, apparently. Why are you setting me on fire? No. No. What? Come on! Wow! Wow! F oh my f- Alright guys, now that we have successfully killed Dragonfly, the only thing left to do is the Ancient Guardian without eating. No, you're not making me fight Dragonfly again. I don't care if I fight her immediately. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, I don't care. There is nothing in the top left of the screen. Okay, this is a pig king forest, which, uh, now that I think about it, the pig king does lead to the pig village. And Dragonfly is also... There's nothing over there. And the pan flute's also right here. We're gonna just grab that so I can kill... The ancient guardian. We even found marble and the rook. I think the world's trying to tell me something, but I'm not sure what, what. You know, I was going to kill Dragonfly, but then you punched me in the face. Now I'm not going to. Fine, we're going to go kill Dragonfly. We might have 50 less health than last time, but we're going to do it. And you know why? Because this chest. Quickly. There was no healing in there. That's just stupid. How am I supposed to kill Dragonfly now? Alright, it's time for round two. I'm going to avoid some damage by doing this. Oh god, why did the hounds have to get involved? Why are you attacking me? Why, why is the, the hound on me? There's a bigger enemy right, right in front of you. Okay, hound, come on. The other guy kind of died, but we can do this. Don't retarget to me. Why did you retarget to me? Oh 
Oh, oh my god. Come on, we can do this. We're 15 away from starving. Yes. We can tank it, we can tank it, we've won. The hound has helped me. Kill the dragonfly, we did it. We killed dragonfly without eating it, and we got the egg. You know, I'll let you kill me, because you helped me out. Or you can eat the meat, that works too. Alright, now it's time for the last boss. Ha <laughs> ha the challenge is ruined. If I was heading into the runes, I would normally pick this, because you can get like speed boosts and gears that you can eat, but wait, you can't eat anything, and also you start with 125 hunger, which is a lot less than 200, so I won't go Wix at all. So a few people complained that I didn't show the proper way to find the runes last time. I'll show you the correct way to do it this time. Basically what you want to do is turn off your light. And just like that, we have fast traveled to the ruins. We might have a little bit less hunger and a completely different inventory. Almost as if we regenerated the world. And to that I say, Hey look over there, it's the Ancient Guardian. Someone also joined my game. You know, this whole time this server's been on open, so this could have happened much earlier. Alright, I have 26 hunger left, which isn't a lot, but now I can start fighting the Guardian and deal 111 damage per hit. Second phase? I don't think this guy is, e is even gonna make a torch before I kill the guardian. There's a bishop on me?! Why is there- The guardian is literally cheating. You, you can't just have a bishop join you and help you in the fight. Oh my f- what, what, what? Uh, Where is this guy? Here he is. Look at this, this guy thinking he's so cool and awesome. I'm going to cook you alive in an oven. Stupid bishop man, literally the worst clockwork. There you go. How does it feel to be unfairly targeted randomly? That's a lot of fire, he should die any s- yeah, there he is. Alright, we have the player 2. This is officially a two player run. Nothing about the original challenge said you couldn't use more players. There is only one rule. No eating. <laughs> Suddenly something makes a lot more sense. Maybe it's the title of the world. See this food? You're not allowed to have it. <laughs> no eat- yes, he gets the idea. <laughs> no, he found Chester, that's like completely useless to our run. Now this guy is Wix, so uh, we have to get down to the caves fast, otherwise he will starve. Let's go. Quickly. I only have 62 hunger and you probably have less. Shit, I'm going down, I think he's- oh, he's starving! <laughs> Wix is a very poor character choice for this, he is the like- we're at the least amount of hunger. Do you think we could revive each other to get more health? Oh, he found Hutch! Oh, he's dead. Okay, this is what's gonna happen. I'm going to kill a spider and revive him. Then later, I'm going to die, and he's going to revive me. And through all of that process, we won't eat a single thing. Alright, I'm about to die. Don't revive me immediately. Alright, <laughs> now it's... Now it's time to continue the run like this. A decent amount of hunger as well. This could work. This strategy actually works. See, Wix exploring the ruins is a lot better than you might think it is. Wix has this stat where clockworks take longer to aggro to him, meaning it's a lot safer for him to walk through the ruins than it is for me. Is this it? Yes, yes, yes. We did it. All right. Yes, we're back in action. Oh, he's dying. I don't have that much health, but we can get it back with this bat pack. Let's revive. No! It's just up to me now, and I don't know where he is. Ah, there he is. What? You can't do that. I need to abuse him for health. It's the only way I see myself winning this. I have to do this to gain health. Even if it makes my sanity go down. Okay, actually, you know what? This isn't the worst in Bat Bat is great. There's a little guy on me over there. I can kill them because I'm Mighty Wolfgang really easily. Uh...
Alright. They're both dead. I have a bit of sanity now. Okay, he's phase two at least. That one random bat bat carried the run. He's about to die. Day six without eating anything. Alright, before I end the video, I just have to say this, otherwise that one guy will get mad. Hello everyone.